Hi guys, it's Liz Sneddon here. Just giving you some info about data sets for time series and a good source of these. Um, so uh, one thing I have been doing the last couple of years is there is a website from the Statistics New Zealand um, data set. So they, Stats New Zealand collects data all the time and a lot of it they release. So there's a website called InfoShare. So here's the link archive.stats.govt.nz slash infoshare and this is where they store a lot of information so for example I might want to look under um, not under the tourism one um, so I look under work earning and income so I can look under each of these and it, for example here's a data set that's collected quarterly um, March, June, September, December and it's the average hour earnings by industry um, and so if I load that up I can pick and choose or I can just select all of them and in this one I can see um, the data set goes 2019 quarter 4 and it goes all the way back to 1989 quarter 1 and I can display it on the screen but more useful for me is to download it as a CSV file um, so there's heaps and heaps and heaps of data sets there and it's just a matter of having an explore of those and when I get that data file where has it disappeared to I've forgotten to press the go button so here is the data file and I just need to tidy it up a little bit so at the moment it's got too many lines for headings and stuff like that um, so I just need to tidy that up and then I can save that and give that to my students to use um, so as I say there is a heap of different topics here um, I've done things like visitor numbers though at this point in time with COVID-19 I don't know if I would keep doing that right at the moment um, but there's all sorts of different things that you can look into um, here um, you know all sorts of different things so have a little explore of that and see what you find